Well, why is Twofer in the punishment corner? I said time to end the charade and adjust my schedule to buy a new vase. Oh, you stay there. You stay there until you die. Look up the pronunciation for schedule on the internet. Schedule. Ha! Stay in the corner. Wait, the computer. It's, it's Jack's voice. America. Whiskey. Liberal. No, that can't be Jack. Why would his voice be on some random website? It's impossible. Lemon, lesbian, Frankenstein wants her shoes back. Oh my god, it is him. I love unicorns. I told them not to. Let's get out of here, Jack. I tell you what. Make me say anything you want. Get it out of your system. Obama is very presidential. All right, enough. I was trying to be a good sport, but you should be ashamed of yourselves. A bunch of 30-year-olds sitting around acting like college freshmen. Hey, I'm almost 46. When some of us had to spend their freshman year making those recordings and leading a disastrous monkey escape. Grow up, you children. That went well. Hello? Hello, Pete. This is Jack. Jack? Hi. Oh, okay, look, what happened was Suzanne from Ant Sales got pushed into me in the elevator. I didn't try to touch her. And the sort of, uh, sound I made was about something else. Pete, will you be my friend? Friend? Sure, of course. You know, whenever I tell my wife a work story, she pointed this out the other day. I always, always smile a little when I'm talking about you. I wish I was more of a free spirit like you. Now, freestyle rap for me. Rolling with my homie, a me and Jackie D. A bitches get ready for a sex party. <laughs> <laughs> Pete, can I tell you a secret? Of course. I told you about my blankie. <laughs> I'm lonely. Would you like to come to my office tomorrow evening and hang out? Bring your guitar and some beer in cans, and we will jam. OK, yeah, great. And about that Cable Town stuff. Maybe we could talk about some new opportunities for me? Yes, I will make your dreams come true. Make sure you wear one of those Mexican ponchos. OK. Yes. Liz, we're pranking Pete, and it's going too far. Please, stop us. Why would I? I love pranks. I'm not the RA. No. But someone has to be that person. Hey, everyone stop. Listen to us. You ready for this, J-Dog? Jam out, drink some brews. Talk about everything and nothing. After today, that is exactly what I am ready for. Beer me. <sighs> Sitting around drinking beer while a guy in a poncho plays guitar, this is what I always pictured college being like. I wouldn't really know. I only had about two weeks of real college before Paula got pregnant, twice. She had overlapping pregnancies five months apart. Hey, Pete. Do you know Aqualung? <laughs> Sitting on a park bench, air, I don't know the words except park bench. Pete, how do I know that the colors you see are the same as the colors that I see? Maybe what I see as red, you perceive as green. We should be writing this stuff down. <laughs>